CBS 4 News is following a developing story. A Broward man is facing terror-related charges. They stem from what the FBI says he posted on websites used by terrorist groups. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live in Pembroke Pines with the very latest. Hank? Well, the folks in this gated community Friday certainly did notice lots of helicopters, lots of cops, lots of FBI agents in their complex. They weren't sure just exactly what was going on. Now they know. Let's take a look. This is a mugshot of Tayyib Tahir Ishmael, a 24-year-old male who lives in Pembroke Pines. The feds have charged him with posting how to build a bomb information online. This according to the U.S. Attorney's Office, a violation of federal laws that address the crime of violence, weapons of mass destruction. This video from Chopper 4 taken Friday when federal agents raided Ishmael's Pembroke Pines home. The FBI, the cars, the police, but we actually, until now, we don't have information to what's going on. Ishmael was taken into custody, appeared in federal magistrate court this morning. Documents indicate Ishmael posted the bomb making instructions online between mid July and mid September of this year. Ishmael will be back in magistrate court on Wednesday, the 26th. Yeah, I saw the helicopter in the night, yeah, yeah in the evening. And I was wondering, the helicopter was going around, coming around, and I was mm -hmm. keep looking till after I got out to him come back. I never know that. I was wondering what happened, what happened, why the helicopter is like that. Well, Ishmael has a very interesting connection. Listen to this. He was a roommate of James Medina, who is serving a 25-year sentence. You might remember this case. He was plotting to blow up a South Florida synagogue and a Jewish center. But much more for, on this story tonight at 11 o'clock. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News. Back to you.